double story. Lamborghini. When asked, someone would never say we are in a, this rural area where you could really find houses like these ones here. I know it's dusty down there, but bear in mind, we are in a, in a rural area. That is right here in south africa guys and what i've just discovered is uh people are building they're really building so you walk with me here as i'll be giving you the updates of this area of this beautiful of this beautiful residing area. This is actually a setup. This is actually a setup, guys. Just to imagine, guys, you're right here in South Africa and you're at a, uh, in a uh, rural area such as this one and see these kind of houses it's just mind-blowing I just want to be honest with you um, actually I've got a special visit to this area in the one thing you guys to see the beautiful homes even in the rural areas like this one this area here is uh, some kilometers away from from Johannesburg but I'll be giving you the name let me just give you the house outside tour how they look like and uh, this area here is just a certain area I don't know I, I think maybe it's a size of uh, about uh, maybe 10 stadiums 10, 10 yeah, football stadiums it's not that big but I can tell you the houses are massive massive it's only maybe we might complain about the dusty but the dusty road as you can see but uh, this is not a matter guys because I think it's something that they will do about in the very next near future and I think they could be helped with the with the municipality or the um, you know just to have these guys here with their uh, roads nice roads I think maybe the government the government they need to to get involved in this but other than that guys I can tell you see beautiful homes and happy families in those homes there so it's like I once came here and uh, there are some 
other areas the houses were not like this you can see this building a very nice wall here as you all know every house here in, uh, in most of the houses around Johannesburg and areas around the South Africa they all have got jurors walls And this area here actually is quite uh, swampy and uh, it's very swampy around here but that needs good engineering when you are you're building a such place like this one but as we are going up uh, the land changes becomes more drier Alright, sis. Yeah. Sharp, sharp. It, uh, yeah. Okay, sharp. Yeah. Ooh. So, there's other thing that I didn't tell you of today, guys, huh? Uh, it's a voting day here in South Africa and uh, everyone is just going to do something about it you know to cast their votes in the ballot papers this is what uh, this guy's been just um, asking me if I've got this paper that they're just delivering for people around here so guys anyway Let's just continue with our touring. Look at this beautiful house here. Look at this beautiful mansion. The gates. And the garages. Beautiful. Beautiful, and it, even this house here is not a double story, but you can see how beautiful it is. It's competing those houses here, yeah, the neighboring houses. Look at those mansions to my right. It's kind of a complex. It's not only one home, I think. I don't know. Because this, maybe, it's just a home, I think. Yeah, it's just a motion, it's just a home for an individual person. Look from here, I don't know if I can just do like this. Can you see how beautiful this area is? And well protected as well. A nice jewel hall and uh, a nice electrical fence on top because you can see from this area here you can see this side is swampy and uh, it's bush like so of course they need this kind of uh, security because they are kind of at the end and 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 i'm also approaching a very beautiful home in front of me as well Okay, let's, let me just walk you up there. Like I was saying, guys, it is a voting day in South Africa. And I think I'm gonna be releasing this day, this uh, video, this very day as I'm taking it. And I'll be encouraging you, South Africans, to go out. <laughs> yeah. And you know, there are also people out of this, out of this, uh, um, country abroad places like London places like uh, you know New York and all that they are voting they are voting even though they are voting for 
therefore it is for south africa but uh, you can imagine all the way that area i mean all the way to united states to london people voting from there voting to the country for their country it's just an amazing thing you know so you guys i, I really encourage you to also do the same come vote look at this uh, beautiful house this side and you can see with the people who are busy addition um those pamphlets or something it's an amazing and um i believe the boss will go well Mama. <laughs> Look at this beautiful mansion here. Damn. It's not even finished yet, but you can see how it's looking like that double story. Ooh. What do you think, guys? area here has got beautiful houses and um, I really wanted to come check on some of these buildings in most of these houses last time I was here they were not looking the way they are looking now but I can still see there is still a lot of work to be done and mostly I just encourage them um, the government to do something about this for people who are building nice places nice nice place like this they need um, I think they need your hand they really do they really do look at these homes here look at this look at that but I think um, I prefer this kind of uh, walls that are not really like high you know at least you can see inside from the outside this kind of walls yeah if your house is beautiful you want to showcase to people you make a euro wall like this a wall like this and even this side here looking great as well beautiful house and if you look um at my right you will see some bricks there a huge uh, stand i don't know how how big this is but you can see it's a huge stand very huge meaning to say when you when they start building the building a mansion there just like their neighbors as you can see Ooh. This is beautiful. This is the South Africa for you guys. And uh, just to remind you, it's, uh, this place, it's not like, uh, I don't know, how can I put it? And those, you know, rich areas, actually it's, um, it's just a black community around this area here they are not rich people um, but I think rich in what they do not yet financially but uh, these guys here they're just making it as you can see they're making it they're making it happen I think what I I think is uh, if you are someone uh, maybe living in a certain area where you think this is just this is a poor area I think we can just you know stopping I mean stop thinking like that and stop thinking positively and uh, do what we can do with those uh, places that we call poor if you can 
do better by renovating, starting by renovating your, your three room doors, making sure that your area looks good. That's all about it. Make your own setup from where you are. Because sometimes acquiring these lens uh, can be very expensive sometimes. Not sometimes, always. So not everyone is privileged to do that. Not everyone is uh, fortunate enough, you know, to be acquiring these stands. But uh, I believe everyone has got a home, right? If got where, if got somewhere where you, where you do belong, where you are now, I believe you can improve where you are. Yeah, that's all about it. You need to be encouraged by this. So I just took a turn, go in and came out. So this area here is right in Hamanskra guys. Hamanskra. Can you believe that? Wow, it is. Hamanskra. So you see, coming from that beautiful residential area, beautiful suburb right here in uh, Hamaskar you would find there is this beautiful mall as we are approaching <laughs> and along the way just from that out where I was just shooting that video guys I'm coming down there right uh, can you see the car that is approaching on that uh, hump that's exactly the term we took from this other suburb area where I've been just like showing you the beautiful houses. So when you come out from there, this is what you meet from the outside. A busy road like this one. Let's just go up there. Let me just show you a little bit of this area. And um, you can see right here to my left, there's this beautiful complex yeah very beautiful complex i don't know if we should just like get in there for a while and see that's really transforming from this side here as you can see everybody is walking around doing whatever they have to be doing So it actually is a beautiful complex there that I'll be just showing you. So this is what you find when we are out here from the suburb area that I was just showing you now. To my left, there is a Jubilee crossing. That's a nice mall there. And you can see the guys that are doing some business here, selling some maize crops. And it's a voting day. Actually, the voting started today. That's the most busy when it comes to voting day on the 29th of May. So you can see guys, to my left is Jubilee crossing and I guess to my right as well is Jubilee crossing. Lamborghini. <laughs> So this mall actually is big guys, it's huge. Because it's sharing that street that we just crossed now now. So it's this side and it's that side as well. So let's just walk a little bit down there. This area is such a, a busy area, I can tell. 
This is actually their beautiful mall right here in Amoskra, guys. Hey, Every shop is around here guys as you can see for yourself electrical gadgets finishes It's a beautiful mall indeed. Jubilee crossing in Hamaskara on a voting date, the way that one is this other guy is parking let me just go this way <laughs> guys it is a really a beautiful Harman's crowd you should visit here Some furniture shops around. Wow. 
Yeah, so guys, this is the Jubilee Mall. You guys, I'll be seeing you in the next one. Um, I hope you had a nice time. I hope uh, you really loved this. Subscribe to the channel, guys. And also, give the video a like. I'll be seeing you in the next one. Bye for now.